okay. what you want. I'm going to film people before we leave, uh, Elliot. Yes. What are you going to miss the most about the interns? These interns. Uh, that's putting me on the spot here. You know, I like know. <laughs> here, Daniel entertain us while he thinks. Hello. Oh, I think that you guys have been a, <laughs> it's been a great group, collectively. I think that's been what's most striking. It's just it's the whole spirit here and when people come in. Well, let me ask you one more thing, though. Okay. If you had to give us some parting words of wisdom. <laughs> you've already given us many. You're asking the wrong person. Parting words. It can be about anything. It can be about life. It can be about Jamba Juice. Women. Or men. Before you know. The women. Or you know, both. Uh, <laughs> parting words of wisdom. Yes. Can I make it really trite? Yes. <laughs> Can I say like be yourself? Yes. Okay. That works. <laughs> Please shame. Uh, <laughs> welcome, to tele <laughs> welcome to television. Okay, let's take a tour. Amanda, do you want to take us on a tour? Sure. Actually, I. Okay, we'll follow her back. Enjoy taking tours, but welcome to Dan Rather Report. We will now deem this section as cubicle row. This can be, yeah, cubicle row one, or our, A. Our board where we don't write anything. Oh. Mm, sadness, because we have Google Docs. Thank you, Internet. <laughs> our lovely kitchen. <laughs> Complete with coffee maker. This is a nice coffee maker. Yes, and, and microwave. And water cooler. Let's, let's, we should do a crew thing. What's in the refrigerator? Oh, yeah, right? <laughs> oh, you know, on the weekends, I just lots of beer and diet This is how we roll a Dan Rather report. Perrier. Yep. All right. That was good. All right, moving over into. Here's where all the higher ups sit, minus me, because I'm not a higher up. <laughs> All the executive higher up. Elliot, Mr. Nelson. Shh, we're going in Mr. Rather's office. So Texas, I love it. It won't, I won't put it anywhere, it's just for me. Okay. More executive offices. This is Bill. This is Bill. Who's going to miss me the most? <laughs> this is just my home video. Bill, say a few words for the camera. <laughs> okay, I'll come back when you feel less put on the spot. It's okay. You know, it's alright. <laughs> and here we have Jay Rocklin, who loves Texas as well. <laughs> Janine is out with Heather. Mm -hmm. Editing room. And our producer's cubicles, it's a research room. Research room. And then down the hall, more edit rooms. And this is the intern room from the outside. I've only ever seen the inside little camera, but this is the outside. So here I am, walking through Times Square on my last full day in New York. I got off work early. Everyone's looking at me strangely for filming myself. So maybe I should film them. I live about two blocks down from here. This is kind of like a main thoroughfare. There are a lot of stores. Almost all the subways come through Union Square. Oh, man, I feel like I'm on the travel channel. It's not very good at filming and walking, though. I could work on that. But yeah, I feel like I need to document pretty much every second of this day. Because it's the last one. As uh, one of the most recent additions to Dan Rather Report, yes. and most recent graduates of college, yes. like all of us are about to be, <laughs> what are you going to miss the most about this group of interns? What am I going to miss the most? I think probably y'all's determination. You are, all of you in your own way, are very um, vocal, which is great, and always wanting to do something, always wanting to learn, always wanting to throw yourself in the middle of stories which has been great because you guys have really taken the initiative yourself to do that and I think it's really, really benefited um, all of you guys. You've gotten to do some amazing things um, years ago to now. Um, you guys had so many incredible experiences um, and you guys really initiated a lot of them, which I think is amazing. So 
um, which is great because you're self motivators. So mm. I have no fear or worries for you guys in the future. That's good news. That's one less person. <laughs> so I, I guess have to say, <laughs> what words of wisdom would you give us? Um, always be true to yourself. Um, never do anything that you know to get to the top, as you say. Um, because the top can be fun, but when it's all taken away, what do you have left? So you always need to be true to yourself. You need to be honest and you need to remember why you got into this. That was beautiful. <laughs> that we could be on a Hallmark card. Very sweet. <laughs> I mean, there's like Maybe millions of people. Hi. <laughs> I have a lot of Janine on here. That makes you me really happy. Do, huh? Sam, why oh. do, you guys work in broadcast okay. production. Why are camera. you so Look scared of the camera? The camera. <laughs> Amanda. Hi. Anyways. Yeah, you do have a lot of time. Because you're the only person who doesn't run from me whenever I bring the camera around. I have to sneak in shots of everyone else. But you're very personable. I like it. We're gonna miss Janine, aren't we, Heather? We will miss all of you very much because you guys helped a lot. Do you have any words of wisdom for us? They can be quick and trite. Example, um, Elliot's word, be yourself. Do not play into office politics at any time in your life. Just be yourself, as Elliot said, and always do the right thing. Don't compromise yourself. I like that. Thank you. Let's go find Jeremy. No, don't do me yet. What are you? You want time to think about it? Yeah. Okay, I can come back. But I do have to go this way now, so I'm inadvertently following you. Wait, while you're still here, what are you going to miss the most about us? Um, be honest. Alright, alright. I would say. Sorry, Heather. What? Sorry. Your sunny dispositions. Aww. Uh, no, the way be, you. Be make honest. Me feel like, dude, dude, be honest, dude. 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 My, my dad is honest. <laughs> what else? For real, world, you're off the play play? No, it's for real. For real, world. Aww. I miss you and you and you and you. <laughs> you're last. But I tried not to get, I purposely did not let myself get too attached to you because I've been hurt before. <laughs> Is it high so I'm going to be okay. I'm, I'm going to make it out of this. I don't know about you. <laughs> I told Courtney she said hi yesterday. Yeah. Thanks for bringing that up. <laughs> you just brought the hurt uh, back into the room, Heather. Well, thank you, Jeremy. Good luck, you. For those pearls. Uh, okay, Matt. What are you going to miss most about the interns? Daniel. Daniel? That's Did you so just sweet. say Daniel? <laughs> oh. I thought you wanted to kill me, man. We're having a breakthrough. He's gonna miss that. Oh, the most. Superman do without Lex Oh. 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 <laughs> what about your your words of wisdom, Matt? <laughs> I want to hear words of wisdom from your generation. Which is, you're I guess, I guess our generation. <laughs> she waits till you're like, right yeah, she goes, you have the approach. Everybody. <laughs> <laughs> sit out of your hand and like, Jim, <laughs> um, just wanted to uh, say thanks to an especially great uh, group of interns who have been with us this summer. Um, I, I can't tell you how much we appreciate all that you have done. I can't believe it's August and it's time to go back to school. Um, <laughs> But uh, time has flown by. Uh, I think you guys have been especially fortunate, uh, lucky in some cases, because you've got to see things that other groups haven't had a chance to see or do. Um, and on top of that, you've just been a, a tremendous help. And I hope that you've learned something. I know that Dan has, has given you guys probably more time than he's given any other group. And uh, you know, you, you, you learn so much just from a short conversation with him. Um, so again, thank you all, uh, and uh, please come back anytime. We love you. Get back this way. Um, stop on in. I can always use the help. Um, did you have something you'd like to? Have? Well, uh, one, uh, we. Uh, yes, I agree. You may have been lucky to have been here, but we've been uh, the recipients of great luck. And I don't say this offhandedly that you've been a great group of in interns um, as a whole. Um, best group that we've had, um, worked a little harder, worked a little smarter, every group we've had does so, but we've been lucky to have you, 
and uh, we have uh, learned more from you than you have learned from us. Uh, it may be hard for you to believe that, but uh, your enthusiasm, uh, the way you approach this, I just can't say enough good things about it. And as, uh, as for conversations with myself, I suspect that a lot of that, as it should, just went in one ear and out the other. Uh, but uh, that I will say this, if you, uh, as a group and as individuals, if you continue to have these work habits, and if you continue to work and apply yourself uh, the way you have here, then I have no doubt that whatever your dream is, that uh, you'll achieve it. And I have a, a request, this is not a command, this is a request, that we'd like for you to stay in touch from time to time, uh, shoot us an email, uh, shoot it to Phil Kim, our all-purpose, or all, all, all Heather. Uh, just stay in touch if you can. Uh, if you need help at any time, uh, and we don't say this lightly, and we do not say this to everybody, if you need help at any time, um, let us know, and we'll do the best we can to, to give you help. Um, and if you need bail money, well, well, we'll call us, <laughs> and we will not let your parents know. <laughs> but thank you all very, very much. And so everybody, let's give these young people a round of applause. You know that we the only it. because two of them are Aggies. Let's do a hip hip hooray. <laughs> hip hip hooray. You turn red. Look at that. <laughs> now, we really think you're special because not many people get Billy's cakes. And this is what we have a Billy's coconut special. Icing is worth uh, the price of admission alone. <laughs> so, uh, and also we require three hours in the gym after. <laughs> Thank, Thank you all very, very, very much. Thanks a lot. Well, Home sweet home. I'm back in Texas. Um, as evidenced by my Hill Country shirt. Woo! I'm feeling a very strange mix of emotions. I'm really happy to be home. I ran up to meet my family at the airport. It was really exciting. I had a really good in flight movie, Star Trek, so that helped take the edge off, but I don't know. I'm really sad. I really miss New York. I really liked it, and I really liked all the people I met, and it doesn't help that my cat is really sick, and so I went to go pet him, and he's so skinny, and it makes me really sad. And looking around at my room, uh, which is a complete disaster zone, doesn't make me any more excited. I mean, don't get me wrong, I'm very excited to be home. It's just readjusting. It's kind of like when I went to College Station for the first time and I used to tell everyone I was having like reverse culture shock because I'd never been somewhere like that before. Coming back home is different because going there was kind of like a culture shock even though I've been before and I kind of knew what to expect but you don't ever really know until you live there. So uh, yeah, I'm gonna miss it. I'm gonna miss everyone. I already miss you guys. You can ask Daniel, I cried on the plane. <laughs> just a little bit. But, um, I just thought I'd let everyone know I got home safe if I haven't already texted you or called you yet. And, uh, I'll always be thinking about you. Good night, New York. Oh, look, it's the last intern. The last intern. Mateo! Sounds like, it sounds like a movie. It's it's the last intern. That could be a horror movie. Like, like Hostel. I mean, I'm, in, I'm in your seat, aren't I? It's fine. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. You just look so frazzled. Well, I was here pretty recently. Shoom. <laughs> yes, I'm filming like every minute of our last day. Wow. Everyone's gonna be so like... I can't tape? say anything. I don't have tape, it's digital. What, what about Jamba Juice? Have you, have you documented that? Yes, actually I've got him talking about Jamba Juice and Express. That's pretty wow. much his whole life. That is your life. life. I don't know what I want to do when I get back to College Station. Back. What about... I can't wear shirts like this in College Station. That's well, true, he'll get laughed off campus. Why? In the, in the because it's, it's not like what's, what's cowboy the, what's the enough. Look you gotta wear blue jeans, belt buckle, and Stetson. How big is your biggest belt buckle? I don't have a really big one. 
really big belt buckle? Show us with your hands, Daniel. What's the biggest belt buckle you've seen? Oh, I see. About like, like that size, maybe? And they're all like, like uh, the ones that they win at the rodeo. Right. Because they show... I want to see someone wearing one of those belt buckles that like you can program it to say different things and it lights up. I haven't Have seen, seen that. the spinner ones? They're like the wheels that spin. Yeah, that's so tacky. Those are so awesome. What if you yeah. open Jamba Juice at College Station? There's one. There, there is, is one. one. It's just not nearly as popular in Texas and that's for why some I reason. I never drank there. I, I never drank there. I to get my hair cut because that's where the sports, sports clips are. That's where men win. Um, and now, but, but will you now patronize it? Yes. I'll, I'll, okay. So I'll, I turn the cameras on I'll you? I'll do my patronage. Uh, right if you want to. You know, I would go You're too far away, Daniel. And, and get baklava. There. Right. Right. Almost every I've day. I've never had baklava myself. It's very good. But I studied Russian language, and it sounds Russian. A Russian language or the Russian language? The Russian language. Right. Usually all Russian languages are the same camera woman who's not supposed to talk but uh, okay hold on pause I'm sorry excuse you this is my home video I'll do what I want <laughs> are you are you still yeah I am oh. I was gonna pause it but I feel like the viewers need to see that no. dude it's gotta charge dude. 16 hours dude dude plug it into the wall and turn it on dude you want to charge it first his network first charge to be your best that's the advice that I would give to you guys. the first charge is that's the best <laughs> <laughs> we can apply that to all aspects of our life, can't we, Jeremy? I can't repeat it now because <laughs> I haven't talked to Adam yet. We already okay, talked to Elliot. So I'm already talked to. Uh, okay. So it's charging at home. It's charging. Is it cool? Yeah. It's shiny. Oh yeah. Is the keyboard big enough for you to? Yeah. Get those fine. claws on. It's fine. <laughs> <laughs> I can feel it. <laughs> this I I do. Oh, okay. <laughs> I think the idea was to take a, take a class picture. Uh, did you get everyone a camera so far? No, people normally shy away from it. Yeah. They say, "Oh no, camera!" I'm like, "You're in production." <laughs> All right, Nicole, say something for the camera. Go for it. For it. It's the Hudson River. Oh my goodness! Oh, he's going forwards. Oh, he's going forwards? I'm just going to go backwards. World. The whole world. Whoa! <laughs> <laughs> Oh my goodness, you're so smart, you're the smartest boy in the world. <laughs> 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 